of my logo on the side of Oh my God. Stop, 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 stop. Well, welcome back, everybody. The American Outback. Here on Farming Simulator 17. Woohoo! Here on Mr. Blue Farms. Folks, today we are going to sell us some milk. Try to get some of that money rolling in. Let's go ahead and get that rolling. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about right there. Let's see how much more milk we got. We still got to do uh, some harvesting on fields 8 and 7. And I think 1 and 20 also. So, yeah. Uh, and also 2. So we got to get busy. Uh, first, let's uh, check on our animals. See, all that looks pretty good. Um, cows need some power of food, so we'll give them some of that today. Uh, and the pigs are going to need some food also where it looks. So no problem there on either one of them. That'll be quick and easy. So, folks, uh, let's make sure all of our things are good to go. You know, we're just started. Um, everything's off. Plant growth's on. So, we're all good to go there. I was going to check how much more milk we had. Uh, 161,000. So, that'd be one more good truckload. We'll try to get that in, too, today. So uh, let's go ahead and jump over to our combines and get them started. I already got them, the tractors on the follow me, so that's good to go. And folks, as you can tell, as you can tell right now, cross our fingers, there is nothing wrong with the game. Now I did take out... Uh, you know, here while back, we had a little tragedy with uh, Matthew, and I uh, inserted a couple of the police cruisers and stuff. I did take a few of them out, the helicopter and the trailblazer. But uh, I still got a couple to go, so I hope that fixed it. So everything's going pretty good so far. Come on, tractors. Uh, Jason the Boo's on the combines. Jenner and Matthew's on the uh, grain carts. And I'm going to be working on uh, feeding the animals real quick while they're doing that. So let's see here. Yep. I don't know how much. We still pretty good. 126,000 on power of food. Um, look like our machine's working and it's pretty full. So that's good because this truck here is full. All we got to do is go feed them. Now, I don't know. Uh, I'm probably going to have Craig at test mount that Kentucky truck. Whoa, hit inside of the thing there. It's supposed to have a uh, box trailer like this right here, this complete setup. And if I can get it to working, I'm going to swap them out. Next episode or two, hopefully. And, uh, yeah. Alright. Uh, oh, Mr. Blue. Y'all see that? I tried to dump that in the water trough. Betsy and Rosie and, and Posey over there probably looking at me and like laughing their butts off. Oh, yeah, there we go. Oh, look at all that power food going in. And it's going to take every bit of it, too, ain't it? Holy cow. Y'all was hungry. Uh oh. Good way to bust the tire out. Alright. 
They got a load of food, so let's go over here and get the pigs some pig food. I don't know if there's any in this mixture or not. We'll just let that fill up. Go back and check on our... See where our combine's at. Let's see. There's combine at 76. Must be that in there. So control F. Ah! I hate when I do that. I got too many things up there. Where's the other combine at? Um, he's 70%. So I hope this is the one that's at 80%. Get that pipe out. Whoever you are. Don't know you're Jason or Blue. And these are the ones that run about 15 mile an hour. Which I like, but I think after this harvest, we are going to trade them in, though. But why? Well, I like to get us some uh, new hollands, in a way. There we go, get the speed set. Come on, hurry up, empty. You're almost there. Alright, there's our sign. There's our sign. Come on, there you go. Okay. Oh. Control F. That's one thing I like about the follow me mind. They're right there with them. You don't have to draw it. Drive halfway across the field to get to them. And with the John Deere's, I don't know if it's the header or what, but you see how it's up past? They won't back up. I, I'm, not, I'm gonna keep them hired. So we can see for sure. But I guarantee he will not back up. I guess it's a he. Nope, that's Boo. Boo must have done her hair this morning. She got a rag over it. Towel or something. But anyway, folks, this this watch it here. Uh, let me do this real quick. Get that shortened up. See? Oh, what? Oh, I was wrong. They got it. She got it. Okay, let's see if we can. There we go. Should be fine. There it goes. There it goes. Okay, good. Um, go ahead and get a few other things going here. And also, this tractor here hasn't been used. The coon spur has not been used whatsoever, so. Kind of worried about it. Come on, where's my Homer truck? Okay. Oh, wow. Um, okay, we're out of grain there. We're going to have work getting that filled up. We got plenty of uh, pig food. We got like four or five loads in this storage here, so. Wow. And that was dumped with that other trailer. I don't know if there's a thing on here. That's the only thing I would change about this system here. It's a, a great system. But it needs a uh, counter somewhere so you can see how much is in it. And I don't know if the pigs are hold all this or not. So I'm, just, you know, I'm trying to take a full healthy load as we go. We're going to try to get some more pigs. This time, well, probably more sheep or cows. The pigs are actually multiply on their own. All we got to do is keep them fed. And then uh, 
Because I really don't want to buy none of them. I want to sell them. Oh, come on. As long as it don't mess up our little worker there. Uh, oh, my little. We're going to let him get my. Have to back up some more. There we go. Let's check on them real quick. Good Lord, our cows need more power for really. Oh, this this is going to work for our pigs. Oh, yeah. We still got some left. Now we're going to have to go dump this back in real quick and then get back to our combines. 55% um, on one of them. Trying to see... Whoa, one of them's at a hundred. We gotta let me do this. I don't know why I'm doing that. That must be one out of a hundred. Lights are on. It ain't gonna take long for them to knock this strip here out. Yikes! It's a good way to get rear ended. And I kind of turn that way, folks. That way it picks up the the, uh, the follow me mod a little bit better. Let's see. This guy's probably close enough to get started. I'm going to drive him over and uh, get him set up. I will probably deal away with the uh, liquid spurs. Since we got a way to do solid furlines, we'll probably just get another furlines buggy. Let's see here. I think that right there should do it. Oh, yeah, close enough. I probably could have got over a little bit more. I'm just going to leave him right there. And uh, see, there we go. If I was in it, it probably would have worked. Hey, come back here. Uh, yep, the other combine stop. Get him back on, follow me. Come on. There we go. Another F1. Go F. So what do y'all think about this, folks? Y'all think this is a... Uh, Pretty nice setup using the follow me. I kind of like it. It helps out quite a bit. See, watch it. I'm in the combine now. And watch it. It'll back up. Maybe it's just that nowhere. I don't know. But we're going to trade these two combines in or get another combine. If I get another combine, I have to stay on them constantly. And if I have to do that, I'll just... Uh, yeah, well, it started to get it. That it takes that whole lot faster. Let's see. Here's this truck. Our sheeps. How how we're doing on our sheeps? Oop. It mean to stop you. She was turning a little bit though. How are her sheeps? Our sheeps are doing fine. We got uh some bales left here. I ain't too worried about these. I think it's just like three or four. Um, we got our pallets up in the truck here. I think there's eight of them where it looks. And uh, when that gets full, we'll haul that off. Uh, we got all the grass out there picked up, so 
Our piggies are doing pretty good, I guess. Um, let's see, how many pigs we got? We got 100 pigs. See, they don't really start helping out till they get to like three to 400. And that's when they actually start getting where you can sell them. Anything over 500 we'd sell. So I like to get some more sheep and cows, get them to about 200 each. Yeah. But anyway, what do our cows? Everything but power food. Okay. So that's good. Dump this off real quick. Dang gum already? Literally full grain tank already. See, I ain't, I ain't got time to, uh, whoa. Get him dumping, and then it's going to be him. Control F. Making pretty good on soybeans. Get back to the other end. We're going to probably have, well, a truck sitting over there, so I don't know. Oh, it would have to stop. It would have to stop. I guess I ain't going to worry about those little pieces. That really won't be... I don't know why I do that. How much has he got? About 70% he'll work till this one gets full. Should be just about empty. And I'm going to say that's probably going to be the last load this one's going to handle. Our main truck sitting over there. So I'm going to hold off just a little bit longer. Okay. I'm going to go get the oven here. It's almost full. Come on, catch up. Catch up. Got to catch up, Jenna. We're going to hit the full mark by the time we get up beside up. Watch it. Nope. All right. Oh, crap. This ain't been set. Oops. Come on. Come on. Come on. Get up there. Get up there. There we go. All right, good. We are set. And this guy's going to be the same way. But I got a plan. I got a plan, I think. Hopefully. This guy here gets empty. I can get over, get hold of him, hit the follow me on him, and then we'll take both of them over, empty them real quick. Combines just have to wait to get full. All right. Oh, they done rolling now. I don't have to stop them. And folks, it's, I need to work a course play for unloading on both of these guys. I think it will work for both. Not too sure, not positive. But we, we need to try it. I need to set it up while I'm not recording. That's the deal. Come on, don't act stupid. Sometimes they want to act stupid and do uh, fishtails back and forth. The question is, is he going to put his pipe out when I put mine out? Because they usually do the same thing, telephone pole. Whew. You know, like if I turn my lights on, he usually turns his lights on. 
But I don't, because he would be unloading. All right, I'm gonna get the pipe out. Get follow me off. And he's gonna be unloaded the time I get done. That's kind of good in a way. These wasn't full, but what can I say? You got to do what you got to do when you got to do it. Oh, that's perfect timing. Perfect timing. And I think that's pretty good, folks. Yeah, all right. Come on, Junior. My question are, where are they? Both of them down the other end. I don't know how, why he covered his. This is where the mods really work out in your favor. The follow me mod is excellent. If you know how to use it right, folks. All right. Look like they're coming back to us. Oh, one of them's full. I'm trying to find. Okay, one's 97%. 98. 99. 100. Okay, I'm going to stop and get this one. Take the follow me off and we're going to go get this other one. Close your eyes, boo. Driving through the beans, driving through the beans. Now, folks, you can get some of those, and like the Spectre mod over, you can get some of that stuff off by detaching some stuff, like the 747. We need to that planter that will go off. See, that's the one that's leaving the stuff there. Come on, there you go. That was perfect timing on that. Is this the one that was boo? Oh. Blue, blue, blue. Boo done dyed her hair blonde. I just wanted she had a towel on her. And see, there's another spot. I don't know why the John Deere's are doing that. But anyway, I want to get it over here and like right here. Watch the inspector mod. I can detach. And they'll go away. See, it took completely off. Um, struck, I can detach it. It'll go off. Now, I can't detach the back of this, so. But if I get it empty, 
that will go away. Detach adding. Uh, that don't have nothing in it. Uh, I need to be using it. He's empty. We need to drive him back, get another load. And uh, that's pretty much it. Um, then I'm going to go ahead and get him started for a round. Where's the button? Tell you what, control F. Go ahead and get up here and get another load. I'm going to take one of them out when it gets back to the other end and probably move it over to the canola. So I want to go ahead and grab this one while it's on the right side. It's on the left side, but it's the right side of the left side. You know what I mean, side? The side being in the crops. Yeah, there we go. Our money is shooting away, folks. Our money is shooting away. Okay. And kind of aim towards it a little bit. F. Switch over to the other one. When it gets down to the far end, we're going to stop it. So I want to switch over to our truck. And I bet you that truck is not. Oh, way back here. Can I make it? Can I make it? Really, at once got nearly full grain tank. All right, we're going to have to boogie it in. Well, I've cut across here because there's a fence right there. And I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. Since we're already in the truck, let's, let's do this. We ain't seen this in a long time. Just kind of help us out till we get up here to the end. Because we're going to pull Jason out and take him to field 1, maybe. Field 20, whichever one comes first. I'm going to try to take him with that header on. I know it's going to be probably a boo-boo, but I think I can do it. Um, if we go up to that main highway right over there be a straight shot to field 20 so how much you like Jason which combine is going down okay I see it now 12% left all right there it goes going up here to the end and uh, wait on them. I'm just going to wait right here. I'm going to go ahead and stop this guy right there. And this guy here, I need a boogie. Because I don't want to have him follow me over there. And this is where it's going to get interesting quickly. Unload. Oh, oh, let me let through. Stop. Jason, pipe out. Finish dumping what we got. Okay, and it should go straight in the truck. Yeah. Good. OK, 
Okay. Ah. Our other combine's going to be pretty much catching up to us. Like I said, we may, you may have to wait a little bit. We're going to try to get this combine as far as we can. Oh, it's right there. Let's get out of the way. Come on, dinner. Eighty-eight percent. We might need to go ahead and just unload him. Let's see. Tell you what, that's what we're going to do. Drake doesn't look well. The thing might be in the way. Just do. Can we do it this way? stop just like where he's at and don't move please don't move because you move there's going to be beans all over the ground there check it out folks still don't follow me too bad we couldn't get it caught like that every time so we got one through left here We'll be done, and we'll have both combines over to field 20 and field 1. Then all we'll have left is just sugar beets. So we are doing pretty good. All right. All right, we're going to go ahead and Try to make a beeline. I don't know if I can or not. That way right there will curve back to the left. So I need to get over here. Oh, take out the fence post, Mr. Blue. This should have had Jason to drive. Oh, who parked a baler in the way? Come on now. Speaking of, I need to get rid of them. I like to do some bailing. We need to do some bailing, but bailing's limited. We got a lot of straw right now, so we won't be having... You're going to mess me up, car, truck, whatever you are. Oh, my God. Please don't be doing no fish telling, whatever that is y'all do. Just drive straight and don't look down. Oh my god, I look down. Oh, this is gonna be a nightmare. Whose idea was this? Whose idea was this? Heh <laughs> Take out the porch, why don't I? I think I can make it as long as no car comes. Dang, I'm auto save scared me. Yeah. This is kind of a breeze. Except for a few I hit. There that wasn't a problem at all. All right, there should be canola. Yep. And he'll follow behind, as usual, and he is empty. So let's go over to our other one. Uh, get up here beside of him. I don't know if we can hold all of them or not. But we'll go ahead and get them empty. And then, uh, yeah.
Oh, he would. All right, folks. I'm going to uh, empty this buggy into the semi truck and get these two pieces of machinery over to the other side of the bridge, and I will be right back, okay? Promise I'll be right back. All right, folks. We've got them over here. Ah, wrong one. Uh, unfold. That's just higher, and that should work. Also got the semi truck down there. And look like look like Jason is full. Yep. Jackie. Ha! Huh? Jackie. Okay, you are following good. Control F. Would be full right there at the end. Well, not bad, folks, not bad. I'm going to hop over. Oh, 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 whoa. I come on now. Yeah, see how he's up a little bit. I'm just going to go ahead and not have to hit R again, but I'm going to back up a little bit here. Not too much. When he gets done, I'm just going to hit B again to hire Um... What is four? I need tab to four. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and get him started. I'm gonna move his truck up out of the way, see how much we got. Hundred and sixty thousand four hundred and five folks. Wow. That's a lot of soybeans. Now one thing on this we gotta see if our pig food mixer needs any. Dump some in it, then we'll sell some. But other than that, you are done, so I'm going to hire you. I can't, can't, can't see where I'm going. Get logs in the canola. 14,160 on that load right there. I'm going to put him back on follow me. Let's go to our other guy. Other combine. Okay, about halfway. And there's our truck right there. We're going to see how far. He might be able to almost finish this field. Folks, we need to buy another field too. We got some pretty good sized headers here now. We'll also need other stuff too. Um. What I want to do with, with this truck empty, actually see how much pig food we got. Can we wait to another harvest or? Let's see here. Hiring 42,000 on pig food. I think that would actually hold us over on pig food for a while. Because they are full right now. And our bean prices are up at, make sure I'm looking at this right, beans, one five, one three, one six. Tombstone grains is one six. So we need to go there to sell our beans. Where's the bat signal? What, no bat signal? Right over areas. That's pretty good, nice area. Right down the road. Okay, let's go there. What is wrong with this truck? It's like it's not wanting to turn. That's unusual for a Kentucky truck. Let's, let's zoom in here. Seems like it's taking a zoom forever. Um, I don't want to do that. You know, all the way to the back. 
Let's shift that up a little bit. Wrong way. About right there. I think we can still turn right there. Maybe that'll help. I have to get a weight put on the front of this thing. I've never thought about that. That seems to make it a little bit better. Alright, we're going to sit right here. We're going to go check the combines real quick. I don't know why I go with them. Yeah, this one here. Wow. Oh, okay. This same one. Okay, let's catch him real quick. Because I don't want them stopping. The faster the day they get done, the faster we'll be uh, getting the crops done. And next time we'll do some planting and, and stuff. Might bring the sprayers up here and run them out, or at least run that little one out. Come on, get up there. Get up there. There we go. We don't need to run that little sprayer out of fertilize and let's get rid of that cone deal and uh, maybe get a coon buggy sprayer, spreader, dry fertilized spreader on the coon part to go wrong with the oven to help out. Because that one ain't going to be able to handle everything. But then again, we might keep it. Come on. And, uh, you know, it's got the carry wheels on it. it got the skinny wheels and stuff, so that'll help if we have to spray after crops are up. So, yeah. I'm just going to leave him here. I think he'll be able to finish it. Oh, God, this one's almost full. Yeah, go ahead and get up there. Get up here, Gina. Oh, man, he's full. All right. I can see it's got the skinny wheels. It's got the skinny wheels. And that would be good spraying afterwards. Okay, where's my truck? Where's my truck? Where's my truck? Right there's my truck. I don't know why I do that. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's get up here and sell these beans. I don't know if I got any beans left in the silo or not. I never did look on that. I was just looking at the price. This is 160000 So we know we're going to get 160000 raw back plus some. Because they're over, well, I overshot my road. Can I go around? Oh, I can't squeeze through that. I think there's a road right here. Yeah. This would be better for us. All right. I'm going to check them one more time before I dump. Before I take a dump. Dump, 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 dump. All right. We have no beans in the silo. But I'll be okay. I hire and... 1,632 folks 1,632 going once going twice oh look at that money look at that money we're gonna make three three hundred thousand come on three hundred oh 350 oh oh folks 364 261,785 harvest bonus, which leads us to 364,182. Wow. All right, we're going to leave him here. Get back to. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, wow, I took that off for. Uh, he's got what, about a round, maybe? Where it looks. Ah. Yeah. Round the list is through. Let's check on the hood. He is done. Okay. You got a pipe out here. 
We'll just go ahead and directly dump this into the truck if we got room. And folks, uh, tell me what you think. Get rid of these harvesters and get some new Hollands, or because new Hollands going to be faster, way faster than these probably. Oh, and we won't have that problem. Oh my God. Oh, shame on me. I went up on a hill too. That's one problem. But Kentucky truck with Kentucky trailer. Well, my logo on the side of, oh my God, stop, 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 stop. I'm mad, folks. I don't know if y'all saw that or not. All on the ground. That's getting where it's happened a lot. And I, I hate that mod. It, it's not a mod that we can take out either. They just changed the reality of it. And I don't know. I don't guess we can take it out. It's, was this an update to the combines? Wow. I was happy, now I'm not. Alright, I'm going to fold these babies up. We'll probably keep these headers. They're not going to go nowhere. But, let me know what you think about the combines. Keep them or nay. Um, then again, we might these keep them for another harvest and uh okay he's following so we just uh go ahead and wait here take him across the road see if we can hit the truck this time around i just love it how it comes out to the end All right, folks, we got about 10 minutes left. Um, crap, I want to get into the sugar beets. We'll probably do the sugar beets next harvest, folks. Let's see if this dumps on the ground. going on the ground too what what the fudge I just, I, I don't understand. I just don't understand. Is it where it's sitting at? Or is it the combine? I'll move this truck over. Or is the truck too tall? Maybe that's about right. I don't know. Nah, let me just do a complete U-turn here. Now these trailers were working good. I 
Ah, come on now. All right, one more time. Maybe it's just where it was sitting at. Okay, I got two buggies to unload. And then we'll have the grand total of the sunflowers. Not sunflowers, canola. Why am I thinking sunflowers? Maybe we need to plant some sunflowers. I don't know. But, uh, come on. Hard unload. See, it's filling that. Always tarp it for some reason. I gotta get a tractor and bucket up here to get that up. He's done. Move him out of the way. Let's get in our truck. See how much. 51,768. Not counting what's on the ground. So. I'm back up over here. Folks, I'm going to go to the shop real quick, get a front loader, get this up, and I'll be right back. All right, folks, this is the third bucket here, and it all looks like it's up off the ground. So, yeah, so two full buckets and a partial went on the ground. So, yeah, that was just lovely. Waste of time and everything. So, folks, I'm pretty much out of time now, and I, I hate to do this to y'all, but, uh, yeah. yeah, I just uh, don't know what to do, folks. We still got sugar beets to harvest. We got fifty-seven thousand eight hundred seventy-nine. We got canola in the thing, so the highest price for canola looks to be right around the corner. So let's go sell a little bit, and then we'll end it. Good doggy. Yeah, it's right there. There should be a highway over here. Yep. So, folks, I'm sorry about the mess right there and being out of time, but, you know, we all got to go sooner or later. So, I got to go get ready, get cooled off. It's getting hot in here. I got to turn my air off so y'all can hear me good. This microphone picks up everything. But with this money, I'm going to try to save it. I know I'm going to probably use some up because of the planting and stuff, but the planting stuff is going to be next time, next episode. All I'm going to do is run the fertilizer across all of the fields, which he should be almost done. And, um, yeah, 
400000 Now there is another mine out. It's an oil pump mine. It's, but it's 650000 times two. You have to buy two pieces for it to make money off of it. And there ha Oh crap. I forgot you was there. Okay. I'll just uh, put you on follow. Yeah. Follow me. And we'll just uh, leave y'all to there for a little bit. I'm going to probably get everything back to the shop. Um, trying to see what we got in here. We do have some sugar beets left. We got some canola left in here. But we are out of uh, wheat and barley and stuff. So we're going to have to plant some of that. Probably plant a ton of barley. And uh, yeah. But anyway, folks, we are out of time. And uh, like I said... I'll tell you what, since I got a little bit more money left, let's go do this real quick. Placeables, I'm going to buy about six more solar panels, the cheap ones here. They work just as good as the good ones, you know. Oh, long way, Mr. Blue. We'll do this real quick, and then that'll be the end of our episode. Uh, I guess I'm right on line. I don't know. It looks like it. Bada bang. Bada boom. Kind of off a little bit. I think it will be. Whoa. Right there and right there. So it's 3, 6, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So yeah, 3, 6, 7, so 3, 6, 7, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. All right, that's our windmills. That's all the windmills I'm going to get right there, okay? And they, oops will bring us $90 an hour. So y'all add that up. $90 times 20. And uh, I'll put the total in here when I do the edit. So uh, yeah, I want to show y'all this real quick. There's some AR frames. For uh, we can hopefully I'll do the Kentucky truck with and see. We got a dry fertilizer spreader. And um, yeah. And some nose there that holds a lot. So try to get that red and white one swapped out. Maybe this is swapped out. I don't know. There's some bigger ones. This one here is done a fine job of the this, this slurry. We still. I know this is digestate. So we got to fast forward time. And get us some more fertilize. We're doing pretty good, but. We're going to be using the crap out of it here pretty soon. And our seeds are doing pretty good too. But other than that, folks, if you like what you saw, please subscribe to my channel. Make one every day, Monday through Sunday here so far. Uh, Sundays might be slacking off here pretty soon. I'm not for sure. But, um, yeah, we'll just go with flow. I uh, got some yard work and stuff coming up I'm going to have to do, and I usually do it on Sundays, plus spend time with the kids. So in other words, but, hey, it's all part of life, right? But folks, hit that subscribe button, like button, share me with your friends, and most of all, have a great day, a blessed day. This truck needs better brakes. And I will see y'all next Monday on American Outback at 2 p.m. But I will see y'all tomorrow on Giants Island 17. Yep, at 2 p.m. Central Time, folks. We're going to have plenty of power food. This thing's filled up, but it only holds 150,000, so they have a pretty good-sized truck set here to get more out of it. But, folks, i got to see y'all later, okay? i got to go back and have a good day, blessed day, and I will see y'all later. Bye.